They say your guy is sleep, trouble go go wake up. I don't know what they do some women. <laughs> I don't know what they do some women at all. I don't know what they do now. Your husband said, don't go through my phones again. Baby, I don't want you to go through my phones and I don't also want to be going through your phones. Then let us be private with our phones. If not me, you tell this kind of thing, I will agree. I don't go even disturb you at all. I will agree. I will even do as if whatever you said is not that meaningful to me. And when you do it, believe me you, the man will start thinking that this woman, you know, yeah, everything I talked before. But this one, she started doing somehow, running from pillar to pool to seek advice that the husband told her not to go through his phone again and he will not go through her phone again. Maybe that phone issue are be causing problem in the family. That's why your husband doesn't want it like that. And for it not to cause problems again. You you better stop it. There are many ways to deal with such such issues. There are still many ways that you can also go to your husband's phone without him knowing as a woman. If this strategy closes, try to open another strategy. Try to look for use another be creative in your dealings as a woman. Be creative. Not just carry, you just see anybody, even the one where, where send your husband friendly request on Facebook. They will just go, they shout, they para, they do, they take, they take, they person send, a colleague send a message for WhatsApp, you know, they do, they take, they take, they ask you, so, they take, they take, they take, they take, Now, only that will push a man to tell you, don't go through my phones again, and I will not go through yours. And, where did I get this thing? I get it from one TikTok content creator, a TikToker. She came seeking for advice, and what will she do? Oh, um, and I decided to talk about it here. They say trouble like them. Nyanga, they go the way come. Now you they cause the trouble in your home. Abi, what do you think? Is she not the trouble finder? She's the trouble finder. To me, oh. Now, after some days, <laughs> this same woman where carry this is from, what's it come again oh, for TikTok? To say, as it was my debate one morning, the one message pop into the husband's phone on, on WhatsApp. One WhatsApp message pop into the husband's phone. So waiting, she will go find her again for the phone where they tell her say, no go to my phone and I know we go to your phone. Now she wants to be to know her son. These were things that I used to do before. But now I don't get that time. The time I have now is to make money. Take care of my kids, look beautiful, do my content, enter house. So now woman when no get work. Now who no get work and who no get dreams to pursue. If you have dreams to pursue, when I see all those kind of things, it's just a distraction. Let me tell you. Just focus on your dream. And you focus on your dream. You see him running after you. Like fly when they run after dead things. So that is it. So back to the gist. He said as the she said uh, has the message pop up that the girl just said hello good morning and you just trying to check up on you and there are still other messages there but there is nothing uh, romantic in those previous messages he said now you can tell your husband and this number was saved in the man's phone and is a female so she now called out the husband that was in the bathroom say honey who is this person he said, oh, say that person and person where they, all these promo girls, where they do, where they sell gadgets, where they sell, uh, where they carry kind of big, big things, promo things now, sell blender, sell electrical things, they will back up and down. Then I saw you take carry the girl number and the girl carry on. And since then, the girl will just stay some time then through message on her as a just send message. <laughs> so maybe the girl is trying to remain in the eyes of is to be customers it's a strategy if you're a business person you know that is a strategy because out of sight they will stop thinking about once in a while you just send message to all those your contact that you collected in your contact list they will still have it in mind that 
they will still have it in mind like, as in how you people met will refresh in their brain again and anytime they will want to buy something like that they will now look for you so that is it and i believe that it's just on our chat you now see women when they say they they are always going through their husband's phone now them even no get any reason to go through their husband's phone the ones will be saying and then be the baba for cheat if you like go through their phone you will never see anything you don't go see any trace so now this woman carried the thing come online and uh, she was just uh, unstable telling us that they uh, asking us question that uh, telling us that she wants to go and confront the girl that we should give her advice what is she going to tell the girl that she wants to call the girl and tell the girl introduce herself to the girl that this man that you are you are always checking up on that is my husband who that let it just end there hey you are feeling insecure seriously that was my comment i said this lady they feel insecure if you know your what forget it if you know your world, that doesn't mean that you should just relax. There are some messages that that you can jump on. But all those harmless messages, <laughs> you just see it as nothing. It's just a business strategy for that girl. A business strategy because of the kind of things she sells. So that was my advice. So you that are listening to the story now, what advice do you have to give to people that prefer? Like that woman, please drop your comment. Be hey, hey. this pig, don't disgrace me in my compound. Back of my compound, one of, our, of my neighbor, the red pig in their farm. Now, so the pig does shout now to disgrace me. I beg, so what do you have to talk to say about this thing? Drop your comment and remember to share this. I look so okay, thank you. It's not all about preparing them. At times, maybe they come down like this so that people will really know you and understand you. Know that you know also fake. I hate living fake life. But at times, looking beautiful, I also like it. So do have a lovely day. Bye. <laughs>